In Conzo now, Cold Springs residents may have noticed a lot of construction projects on 395, but one of those projects is designed to go unnoticed by the public. Channel 2 traffic reporter Brian Hoffman has more. These traffic sensors are on the road just north of Cold Springs. Collecting massive amounts of data without disturbing drivers. It will detect each vehicle coming across the roadway and it will classify it into one of 13 different types. Everything from class one being motorcycles all the way on up to the big triple trailer trucks. NDOT uses the data to plan for the future. Looking at everything from planning what material to use when repaving to the best time for lane closures. And all the while, the information is collected anonymously. There is exactly zero personal identifiable information collected. Um, we're merely counting axles and vehicles. The sensors are underneath the road and is flush with the rest of the street, leaving a smooth ride with no bumps. Make it as smooth as possible because that results in the best data, right? You're not going to get a, a good weight if, you're, if your truck or your car is bouncing around on the roadway. One of the main reasons for this sensor is to log how many semi-trucks go in and out of the state for federal records. The sensor is permanent, and when they degrade over time and can't provide vehicle type, they'll be used as traffic count devices. Covering Cone Zone, Brian Hoffman, Channel 2 News. This project continues tonight with single lane closures from 9 tonight until 5 Thursday morning.